Um, I'm Jesse Eby, and I'm a PhD student here at ASU in Dr. Jurgen Liebig and Dr. Bert Holdobler's labs. So I study, my main interest is reproductive regulation in ant colonies, particularly polydomous ant colonies, where the colony is spread between multiple unconnected subnests, and the queen is only present in one of those nests. So I'm interested in how the ants that spend their time in these other nests know that there's a queen present in the colony um, and what what that signal is so that they don't activate their own ovaries and produce their own male offspring. So I study behavior and chemical ecology um, with these ants. Um, so my actual goal is after graduation are to work at a small liberal arts school or community college where I can focus on teaching. Um, and also do research, and I, I think that ant communication and ant research is something that's it's tractable in most locations um, because there are ants everywhere. Uh, so that can also play a part in that, that students can have access to research and get research experience um, without needing really complicated equipment and supplies. Um, but I also use my PhD to learn a lot about undergraduate education uh, through my TA ships and uh, as instructors of courses so that I can better prepare myself for teaching in the future. So <laughs> I actually started out as a marine biologist and I'm really interested in communication. And so when I was looking for my PhD program, I was looking at what organisms are really good for studying communication other than reproductive behavior and um, communication. And ants have really complex, and really interesting communication systems and vary a lot across species. So that's really what led me into insects, not the ants themselves, but more the question and them being a good organism to study that question. For me, science is fun because every day I show up to work and it's like being a little kid. It's like when you walk around in the forest as a kid and you're like, I wonder how that works or why are they doing that, right? So I get paid to do that every single day. Um, so it's like playing with animals and I get to do field work and lab work. So I spend, um, my ants are nocturnal, so I spend evenings in the deserts from about 8 p.m. till 2 a.m. Moony nights in the summer. So it's, it's a really fun job because you're, you're really just being curious and inquisitive all the time and get to explore those avenues and actually come up with the answers. Um, my advice for young scientists, um, if you're interested, go ahead and pursue it, go to college. Uh, don't let, you know, don't let other things hold you back. If that's really what you're interested in, make sure you pursue it because STEM careers can be really fun and really rewarding. Um, and when you get to college, make sure you find an older grad student or an older undergrad or a grad student or a faculty member that you can do research with and get involved in a lab and really get to know what science is about beyond just the classroom. Because um, it will really give you a better idea if that's the career you want to pursue and what aspects of those careers you want to pursue.